What's up, Capricorn? And welcome to Table Etiquette as with Black Madonna HP. Hope you are feeling good today. Doing those manifestations, those law of attractions technique. Definitely need to bring in some look deep within your emotions. Is this you, Cap, or is this your person? Because somebody, I mean, somebody's not doing good. Look deep within your emotions. Somebody trying to hide their emotions from you. Trying to, um, maybe even trying to, um, what is it called? Self, um, self illusion or something. Like this person trying to bury their emotions deep or something. And, um, don't want to express their emotions or, or, what what let's let's go ahead and get into this reading because what i'm feeling with this person like they're delusional like they not they not trying to feel their true feelings what let's go ahead and dive into this reading capcorn and see why this person is, is a bit delusional and trying not to act like they got feelings for you. Beloved, what's going on with Capricorn's person? <laughs> Live deep within your emotions. Came back out. Recognition. Openness. Attraction. Respect. This respect card came out for Virg too. So you could be dealing with the Virgo. And illusion. I knew it. In this card, say avoid the trap of mistake and a fantasy for a true, true, uh, true soul connection. So I don't know if they trying to bury their emotions and act like, yeah, I'm still the man. You know, <laughs> I got girls, females, male, whatever. But I just use a man because, you know, let's be honest, 90% of people that watch tarot are women. But um, it's like, yeah, you know, I got all these girls. They all want me. <laughs> but you don't love not one of them. Okay, you don't love not one of them, and the person you do love, you. Ch mm. I ain't going there, Cap. Let's go ahead and get into this reading and see what's going on with your person, beloved. What does Cap need to know about this person that's a bit delusional, trying to act as if they don't have these emotions for Cap that's so strong and real? What's going on with this person? And I keep wanting to say, what's going on with this delusional person? What's going on with this person, please, beloved? What does Cap need to know, please? Thank you. Alrighty, we gonna flip them. Alrighty. So for Capricorn, we gonna start down here with uh, this openness energy and see what's up. Be Open that self guidance in your relationship. It's uh, uh, uh. the three of swords, and what is that? The two of wands. This person, they hard headed, and I'm gonna tell you why. It says, Be open to accept divine guidance in your relationship. They're not open to accepting it, they're 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 trying to um block it, guard it. They're del is delusional the right word to describe this person's energy this person is in denial and all kind of stuff like they like even let's say this is them in this three of swords energy they even deny that and oh, i hurt me what you mean but at night it's like can you really deny the pain that you in like this is a person to try to stay busy to keep moving so they don't have to feel so if you see this person cap you might think this person having the time of their life but it's all like a facade so they don't have to feel the real things that's going on within their life it's like as long as as long as they can be busy or find something to keep themselves busy, occupied, a female, you know, something to do, all that type of energy. That's what they're going to do. But they're going to end up falling flat on their ass because they don't have a strong foundation. They're not grounded in nothing. No matter where they go, 
up down whatever they gonna fall because that that the tree you see how dry and brittle is it's gonna break if they try to get on it like yeah this person don't have a solid foundation this person yeah they're closed off to accept divine guidance regarding anything their intuition is shut down yeah they're on something else attraction deep soul counterparts attraction transcend superficiality uh not for this person they got this knight of pentacles and the six of wands like as long as they get an attention they think they still the man but look at the knight of pentacles they not only don't see that they are a knight they don't see how barren the, the ground around them is. They don't see how their life is just in disarray and how things are falling apart because they don't want to see these things. They are being like in this, I don't know, fantasy or something. Like they, Cap, what's going on with your person? This person isn't living, this person can be using drugs or alcohol. Because they, it's like they trying to medicate or use some form of something so they don't have to feel what they feel or have to face the reality of something they did or something. It's like, it's like some type of defense mechanism that this person is finding that's working for them. The weirdest thing. Emotions. Look deep within your emotions. The Magician and the Hermit. Now, here's what's interesting here. These are both Virgo cards. That's first thing. What's interesting here is that these could be powerful energies together. The Magician, the Hermit. And I'm going to tell you why. Because being able to manifest anything into reality and having the wisdom and knowledge to do it. Bomb. Right? But this person trying to manipulate the universe. And... Uh, uh, and not like the the techniques or things that they trying to use ain't working because they not coming from the right place, the right source, the high vibrational energy they need to. They trying to use this old manipulation um, technique. Every I mean, why is there why is everything around them so like dry? Why is everything around this person falling apart and they can't see it? And it's like, here's the light is shining dead in your face, but you're going to tell me there's no light there. Like this person could be a gaslighter. I also just got that because if that's the energy they doing to themselves, they gaslighting, they lying. They, it's, how can I explain this energy? This person is like, maybe it is delusional in some aspects this person act like they don't see what's plain and clear in reality and send dead in their face right like let's say for example what's a good example for capricorn beloved let's say for example you said you told this person straight up to their face you know i don't want you no more i ain't messing with you no more i'm just done i'm done the way they're going to interpret that, uh, they still want me. They're just mad. You know, I'll, I'm going to call them a little later. They just pissed off right now. It's like, didn't you just hear the words that came out? This It's like they don't, they only see and hear what they want to. And it's, this energy is so, I don't know, Cap. But um, let's see here. So we got the world in reverse and the three of wands. Like I said, if you told them it's over, it's not over for them. But why every place this person is has no fruit, no no nothing. And they don't see how their life is falling apart. How how they're, I don't even want to say receiving their karma, but it's got to be karma to a certain extent. Because whatever um, good or bad things you plant comes back to you. Like the seed goes down and comes back up and it has to grow. So if these are the seeds you're around here planting, this is why you're having this type of life. And you know, some people be like, nah, I ain't not going on in my life. Everything's going well. Because in, in reality, this is how they want to see it. But you see that, you know, your best friend ain't called you in, in, in a month and your mom and daddy don't want to mess with you. And, you know, your job is on the brink of, of you know, and you on the brink of being broke and, you know, your finances. But you don't see all this going on. You just. So I don't know what's going on with this person. The divine will help you recognize signs and miracles. But they're not open to divine guidance. And this person needs a miracle. 
the way that they, they sitting here, this person could have lost their car be on a bus stop. Oh, I'm, I'm, <laughs> oh, my, wow. oh, I hope this doesn't happen. <coughs> Excuse me. But, um, I don't know why I was looking at her butt. And some said somebody uh, injection could have popped or something. And I'm not, I'm not going down that road, but respect the emperor and the lovers. So you could be dealing with the Aries Capricorn, but, um, this person's a taker, not a giver. Because, you know, with this emperor energy, this is a person that's, that's like entitled. It's, and they're not entitled because of any good thing that they're doing for people or that they earned it or whatever. This is a person that feels entitled just because this is what their mind is telling them. This is them putting themselves on this um, throne, on this um, hierarchy, telling themselves that I deserve the best, that I, you know, everybody wants me. It's 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 a inflated sense of self when the, truly this is this is this is life right here. This is the reality of their situation, and they are having to take like you may have it to give them right but this person is a taker they totally ignore God period you see this figure coming from heaven trying to help this person they're too busy taking from up you talking about respect this person don't have no respect for nobody. Is how I'm getting it. They could be rude, indignant, um, um, boisterous, um, just all around just a rude ass person. I'm just saying, Cap. What is illusion here? <laughs> Temperance and the star what is it going to take for this person avoid the trap of mistake and a fantasy for a true soul connection now what i want to see is in this temperance card you can tell if it's upright or in reverse okay one is light pouring out light one is pouring out dust okay so this is in reverse even they don't listen to nothing the angels are involved i'm sorry the angels are involved in this person let me see This person does as they please. And I'm sorry this was a more of a love reading. This was a reading that you need to know about where this person energy is. I'll pull some other cards and see what they want to tell you. But the way I pick this person up is this is a, a very um, self-indulging ass person. Like they only care about self, what they can get. Yeah, they cope. You know, they don't have... This person don't have a heart for nobody else. It's all about them. What they want, how they want it, who's going to give it to them. Um, it's tight. I'm sorry, Cross Watcher, but my reads be tight on the Cross Watcher ass, I swear. Well, let's see. What does this person want Capricorn to know? Can we get some um, vibe for Capricorn? What does this person want Capricorn to know? So they want you to know that it was hard to let you go, Cap. And what's interesting about this is, like I said, they're... I bury myself in work to forget you. What's interesting about this, because what I was thinking about is, at the beginning of the reading, I said this is someone that just be doing things, not to think about things, as long as they got people around them or something to do. Like, they don't want to... Like, this, this, is, this is how they process this but the truth of the matter was this the hidden truth yeah truth of the matter is that's how they were trying to accomplish forgetting about you is by staying busy because it was hard to let you go 
and they're saying I want to feel that way again what's interesting about this feel that way again is we have this illusion cards here avoid the trap of mistake and a fantasy for a true soul connection like what way are they talking about feeling like because remember this is a person that that I don't know do they want do they want to feel the way of what it feels like for a person to give 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 and you take 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 I'm sorry I know I know cross watcher I know Dang, I wish, I just, I don't know. When I'm in the sign, I'm all pro that sign. I don't know how many times I'll say that, but. So you came out um, in their energy. What else did they want? do they want Capricorn to know? What else? So, so um. So who bills are they paying? Are they paying all the bills of all the, the different people that they're engaged with as trying to build their self-esteem or keep their ego up or whatnot? But they pay their bills. My friends tell me to just forget about you, but I can't. You know what I get with this card? They harbor some type of anger or resentment towards you, Capricorn, for something. And they talk to their friends about it. You know how some people be trying to say, you know, I miss Capricorn. I'm sorry. I don't, I've never, I've been around guys my whole life. And I've never heard a guy tell another guy, yeah, I miss her, man. That's just not how guys talk. Not a girl might tell her friend that, but guys don't generally talk like that. When guys talk in reference to women, they talk in, in like um, situational. Like she did this or this is what was going on or you know what I mean? Like they talk like that. As far as feelings and emotions, no. So my friends tell me just forget about you. It's because they keep bringing you up. And their friends like, bro, what's up? You keep, man, just forget about her. And it's like, man, you keep bringing her up. And it's like, bro, I ain't worried about her. And it's like, because remember, this person's in denial. <laughs> Yeah, I know there's one thing they ain't in denial about, Cap. They ain't forgot. I ain't going there. They ain't forgot about the Nikki. That's for sure. But what do I have to do to prove I love you? Now, for me, this is this is also like a hidden energy. Like this person loves you out of all of the cards that came out. What did we have? Cups. Then we have a cup here. We had the lovers in reverse. We had no cups. And this is why this is a hidden energy. What do I have to do to prove I love you? But will they ever let you know that, Cap? Hmm. Hmm. This is something they they think deep down within themselves. This person, hmm, who you messing with, Cap? But let's see. What else does Capricorn need to know, please? What else does Capricorn need to know about this person, please? What else? What else does Capricorn need to know about this person, please? <laughs> Told you. They're around there. Like I said, they keep talking. This dog barking, that's them constantly talking about you and their friend, like... Man, just forget about Capricorn. Why? Why you keep talking about Capricorn? Man, I ain't talking about Capricorn. They don't even, because they delusional. They don't even, they can't even, like, fathom how much they keep your name in their mouth. And then they be in denial, like, huh? <laughs> but, uh, hidden secrets may harm you. This is this person, and they're, D delusional state this person can deal with some type of mental health issues I don't know why I want to keep saying delusional but um like if this person continues to be in denial it will all harm them because how you think they gonna feel if you get somebody new and they have to see you be happy with somebody new hugged up with somebody new riding with the top down with somebody new looking good with somebody new smelling good thin down um, new hairdo new move the haircut whatever the case like this person's gonna feel terrible bridge 
successfully overcoming a problem. If this person gets some type of help and stop being in delusion, like if their friend even like be honest with them and tell them like, man, you need to um call that person or you need to do something because you, you always talking about them and they like accept it versus being in denial about everything. I don't know why this person has this denial energy if this is a coping mecha mechanism or kind of what's going on, but uh this person they need they need some help someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want so there's a wedge here and it, someone no it's not someone it's this person's mindset that's coming between you and them like their mindset is messed up and you probably don't told them that before like man What's wrong with you? <laughs> like, sometimes we just chop it up to that. Like, something wrong with you or what's wrong with you? But success is sure with good plans and hard work. I feel like this is for you, Cap. Like, um, whatever you're working on, whatever ventures, whatever, um, things will work out for you. But you do have to make plans. I say manifest, okay? Manifest, manifest, manifest. And that's your plan, right? But um, a financial gain usually coming from something you did in the past. I feel like this is your good karma that's coming back for being a good person to this person. Because the way I know how this person is, this person is kind of stubborn. You know, this person is this, are they, ooh, they're their own God. Mm, mm, mm. But peace and harmony. And this is what Beloved wants to bring to you after everything you've been through with this person. You probably were affected by this person. Um, I don't know. I want to, I, I try to avoid saying narcissist because it's so cliche. But it's very possible that you could have been dealing with a narcissist in this situation, Cap. It's also possible that you were affected in some way by this person and that you're dealing with it um, like long term or whatnot. Trying to get over it. Trying to get back to yourself. Well, let's get three of these and let's close out this reading for Capricorn. Can we get three of these, please? Can we get three of these, please? Hopefully we get some love messages and this person stopped hiding. I think they gave me exactly three. Let's see what's up. Yep. Bay, I miss you so much. So this person calls you Bay specifically. But see what I'm saying? They miss you. What the You are so worth me. See what I'm saying? And I don't know why I don't put the why there because you are so worthy of me. That that emphasizes more of that 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 self-elated um, personality that this person has. You are so worthy of me. Like what the? Wait 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 wait. Just say you know I, I, I'm for you or you know um, you're the one for me. Why I gotta be worthy of you? And the last one is Thursday. So either you seen this person Thursday, this person called you on Thursday. Something happened on Thursday. Okay, Cap. But either way, that's the read I have for you. I know it was a little rough, but I hope you enjoyed it. I try to get some love out of it, but this person is in denial. But um, Cap, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave me some comments down below, and I'll see you soon, beloved. Love, peace, and soul.